Nancy was watching a movie on her phone that day, and because the movie was really interesting, she kept watching it even though it was well past her bedtime. Then she woke up 10 minutes late the next day, and as a result, she was late when she left home for work. So due to the lateness, Nancy was driving the car a little faster than usual. Nancy gets into a car accident because she drove too fast. It was an accident that caused a lot of damage. After that accident, the government brought a new law. Vehicles shouldn't be driven above 40 kilometers per hour on that road. Immediately, the law was affected. There wasn't even a single car accident on the road after that. If we think about it, didn't all this happen because of Nancy? Nineteen sixty, America. Edward Lawrence is a mathematician and meteorologist who loves the study of weather. Lawrence felt that with the advent of computers, he could join mathematics and meteorology. He decided to create a mathematical model of weather, that is, a set of equations representing the changes in temperature, pressure, and wind speed. Thus, Lawrence incorporated the climate into 12 equations. One day, Lawrence wanted to review the data coming from his system, so he decided to examine the data at two times, which had the same equation. The second and first data must match, but after examining the data, he found something very unusual. Even though at first, both data were in the same manner, the second data became totally different within months. Lawrence thought it might be some problem with his computer. However, after finding out that there wasn't any defect from his computer, Lawrence discovered a phenomenon that shocked the entire world. The Butterfly Effect A butterfly fluttering its wings in one corner of the earth may even create a hurricane in another. This is how Lawrence described the butterfly effect. Lawrence doesn't mean that a hurricane will occur directly due to a butterfly. A small event like this, at the right time and place, can trigger a chain of events that may end in the form of a hurricane. In short, even trivial and small incidents can lead to bigger events over time. This idea later became the basis of a branch of mathematics known as the chaos theory. This is especially true for complex systems like weather patterns. Not limited to that, we can also see the butterfly effect in our real life. This is the minute in which things you may do may lead to a major change in the future. Now let's see an example. 1914, June 28th. That day, there was an attack against the Australian Duke. The attack was made with a grenade, but nothing happened to his car. Nonetheless, the car behind it caught fire. That afternoon, he set out to see those who were injured in the accident. While on the journey, he noticed that it was not the usual path to the hospital. After some time, the car broke down. The car's engine stopped in front of a shop. Unexpectedly though, one among those who tried to kill the Australian Duke by throwing a grenade was present there. He was eating a sandwich. As soon as he saw the Duke, he took out his gun and killed him and his wife, who was also in the car. The First World War, which lasted for four years, started there. If we look at this, the First World War began because his driver took another route. That small decision of his later cost millions of people's lives. However, if he had gone through the usual route, a big change would have happened to our Earth. But that isn't predictable either. Let's look around us. We all live through the butterfly effect. What's more, you are even watching this video because of the butterfly effect. Just think for yourself. How did you reach this video? How did you reach this channel? Just think. 